Donald and Douglas are twins and enjoy working on Sodor. They often see each other being really useful. Whenever So whenever you find Donald, you'll find Douglas. And whenever you'll find Douglas, you'll find Donald. One day, Donald and Douglas were waiting for their jobs when they saw an engine passing by. Whee! Dougie, did you see that? What was it, Donny? I think I saw an engine pass by. Hmm, me too. There he is again. Hey, I wonder why he keeps doing that. No idea. Boo! Hi there, I'm Bill and I'm Ben. You two must be Donald and Douglas. I've heard a lot about you. You two are nothing but stupid Scottish engines. Bill is right. We're going to bully you and harass you. <laughs> hey, don't be such racist engines. Oh, shut up, you stupid bastard. Don't you dare call my brother that. Oh, look here, Bill. That engine's such a dickhead. <laughs> hey, Oi, I'm going to get you for this. Now, listen here. Stop being so racist to us. No, you guys are stupid. Na, 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 na. And we love to cause trouble. <laughs> hey. Come on, Ben, let's go and have some more fun. I'm with you there, Bill. And the two engines settled off. Donald and Douglas were very cross. I literally cannot believe we met rude engines. Hey, Donny, we're going to get those two for this. I, I hope they don't cause trouble. Me neither. Ah, you two. Just the engines I need to see. Donald, I need you to shunt some coaches for Gorn's special train. And Douglas, I need you to work at the Blue Mountain Choir with Vulcan, Stuart and Rusty. Absolutely. Hey, we'll get on with it. Thank you, twins. At Natford, Donald was shunting some coaches for Gorn's special train. Did you shunt those coaches for me, Donald? Hey, I did. Why, thank you. You are a very helpful engine. Well, I try my best, Gordon. What kind of special train are you pulling? Well, I'm taking these very special passengers to Vickerstown, and there's going to be a party there for the mayor. Oh, that sounds nice. I'm taking my coaches along the branch line. Well, that sounds wonderful. Thanks, Gordon. <laughs> Meanwhile at the quarry, Douglas was collecting some trucks to take to the hopper to collect rocks and stones and dust. Douglas passed Stuart and Falcon and said hello. And he took his trucks to the hopper to get the rock, dust and stone. Soon he spoke to the engines. Hello there, is your name Douglas? Why, yes, it is. Well, it's nice to meet you. I'm Falcon. I'm Stuart. And I'm Rusty. Where are you going in these trucks of rocks? I'm taking them to Brendam Docks. They need this to make clay. I take it the ferry needs to take it to the mainland. Oh, yes, absolutely. The mainland's going to convert this rock into clay so people can make teapots, bowls, cups. Any clay models. That sounds very exciting. Aye, it sure is. Anyway, I've got to go. The fray will be leaving soon. Bye, engines. Nice to meet you, and I hope to see you again soon. 
At Bantry Station, Bill and Ben were shunting trucks, although they were coming with a naughty plan. Hey Ben, you know we shunt those trucks here. We should shunt them very hard so we can destroy the station. I oh, that's a great idea, Bill. Let's do it. <laughs> Let's do it again! Let's get away before anybody sees the accident! <laughs> what a bunch of troublemakers we are! I, I agree! It was a terrible mess, but luckily no one was hurt. The station was destroyed, and the trucks weren't broken but they were in a lot of trouble. Thomas, Percy and Edward saw this and were very surprised and thought of a plan. Oh dear, we need to get Rocky and the and some workmen to clear this mess. I agree, Edward. The station looks completely destroyed. Well, if we all work together, we'll be really useful engines and Bantry will be fixed again. We're with you, Thomas. Now that's the spirit, you two. Soon the engines got rocky and the workmen brought another crane to fix up all the mess that's been made. Well done Rocky, that was absolutely good. But I found out it was two engines called Bill and Ben that caused this mess. Oh dear Edward, I think we need to report it to the Fat Controller. Quite right, Rocky. That night, Bill and Ben were just about to rest their wheels when they heard Donald and Douglas coming up to them. And they saw the Fat Controller walking out of Douglas's cab. He was cross. Bill and Ben, I need to have a word with the both of you. I found out from Edward that you caused a lot of trouble at Bantry Station and destroyed everything by shunting the truck so hard. Luckily, it's all fixed again. And we also hear that you've been insulting Donald and Douglas. I am not very happy with this sort of behaviour. I expect a full apology to them right now. Yes, sir. Donald and Douglas, Ben and I apologise for insulting you and for being racist to you this morning. We shouldn't have done that. Oh, that's okay. We forgive you. I, we think you're really useful engines. Hey, that's nice. So, if you don't mind, can we be friends? Oh, absolutely. Thank you very much. That's settled. Well, it's nice to see you for makeup. All four engines are now good friends, and Bill and Ben have decided to make up for the accident they caused at Bantry Station and will never tease any engines again. Well, at least for a little while, of course. <laughs>